On the right, you can see options to either sanction apps so that people can keep using them or unsanction them to block them outright from being used. But rather than unsanction these apps one by one like whack-a-mole, there's a better way. And that's with automation based on the app's risk score level. This way, you're not manually configuring 1,000 apps in this category. Nobody wants to do that. So I'll head over to policy management and to make things easier as new apps emerge, you can set up policies based on the risk score thresholds that I showed earlier or other attributes. I'll create a new policy, and from the dropdown, I'll choose App Discovery Policy. Now I'll name it Risky AI Apps, and I can set the policy severity here too. Now I'm going to select a filter, and I'll choose Category first. I'll keep Equals, and then scroll all the way down to Generative AI and pick that. Then I need to add another filter. In this case, I'm going to find and choose risk score. I'll pause for a second. Now what I want to happen is that when a new app is documented or an existing cloud app incorporates new Gen AI capabilities and meets my category and risk conditions, I want Defender for Cloud Apps to automatically unsanction those apps to stop people from using them on managed devices.